This is an exciting time of year for all of us at Rapla, knowing that we're going to see the new Hero Lure come out. But this year is a little different. This isn't just a Hero Lure. This is a lure that is really unique, but yet the bar is way up here. Every year you've got to come out with a new design, a new concept, and when you think about this particular lure and coming out, it's got to fall in the footsteps of the Shad Wrap, the Floater, the Countdown, the Down Deep, the Husky Jerk, and then most recently the DTs, and how that's been a successful tool to anglers around the world. This year, here it is. The new x wrap what a challenge for you and your staff. This is not only a unique lure, but the ingredients that are in this little baby is just like baking a cake. How difficult was it to produce this particular lure, Yarmo? Well, this lure started as a dream lure right after the millennium. We were thinking about what would be the perfect lure for the 21st century. And this is what this lure is all about. Nobody asked for this lure because nobody could ask for so much. Hey. It looks like a piece of jewel. That's what makes it interesting. But you should all see this in water. I mean, that's what this is, lore is all about. It's all about the action under water. This is an extreme action lore. This lure has been in development for almost four years. In that time period, you've worked hard and we're working to perfect this. And what we've got is a product that can be fished anywhere for any species of fish in a variety of conditions. It took us two years to get the technology for this lure, to get the weight transfer mechanism for the long cast system with the tungsten ball there and with the stainless steel balls that go to the back of the lure when you cast it. And then with the first twitch, they go to the front part of the lure that gives you the right action and the balance. The welded uh, wire that goes through at the lure from the first front hook to the, to the hook in the tail. To develop the technology to have the holographic foil sealed inside the lure. To have the technology on the, on the scales and the lateral line that you have inside the lure. And to have the perfect balance with the, with the swimming lip here that makes the, the action so great. And also, all the little quality details that we have, the stainless steel 3X split rings, the uh, black nickel pyramid point VMC hooks, uh, develop the teaser tail that attracts the fish and, and triggers the fish, all the fine little details. It took us two years before we even got the first prototype. But we always take it further in our development process. We want to make sure that we get it to the pros out there that fish a lot of lures and have a lot of history with lures to make sure we get the correct actions, the correct buoyancy, the position of the head and the tail, and so on. We send it to guys like Larry Nixon and Bernie Schultz and Rick Murphy in the saltwater market. And in fact, right now, as we're filming this piece, Alphonse is over in Dakota just whacking giant smallmouth on even a prototypical lure. Oh, whoa, 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 hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on, baby. Look at that, huh? Eight up, that X wrap. Oh, I love catching these things. And I catch them all year long from ice out to ice up. You know, most baits have uh, seasonal windows of opportunity, you know, where they really work the best. But that isn't the case with the X wrap. This is really a unique lure. You can fish it very, very aggressive or very, very subtle. You could fish it real early in cold water. You could fish it in the middle of summer when the water is real warm and really get a dart and diving action with it. It's an extremely, extremely versatile lure. I've never seen anything like it. It's one of those few baits that you tie on at the beginning of the season and you never take it off your rod. It works on any body of water for all kinds of fish all year long. I think this lure is going to fill a niche that no other lure company has. and It's going to be a great seller for Rapala. It's an incredible lure. I spent probably three months with the research team trying to perfect this bait and we got it where it needs to be. I'm telling you, this is an awesome bait. This bait, in the hands of a novice, he can achieve those, those actions, that wide swing to the side to side, which is what smallmouth and spotted bass really like. And that's one reason this bait's going to catch a lot of fish for everybody. Oh, in the Florida Everglades.
in the springtime, fishing these real, real tight ponds. We're catching snook, we're catching bass, redfish, little tarpon, and trout. All on the new X-Rap by Rapala. One of the things, you gotta have a lure that has a lot of versatility. And what I mean by that is, you as the angler, the, the better the lure works, the easier your job becomes. And the one thing I like about this new X-Rap is that it fishes shallow as well as deep. And now all you've got to do is understand that if you're fishing in three feet of water or more, you work the rod tip down. If you're fishing in three feet of water or less, you're going to work the rod tip up. You guys got to come down and test some of these Rapalas with me. The unique thing about this lure is that you can fish this extremely slowly with a subtle presentation, but you can also fish this extremely aggressively, power fish it, and it maintains its balance anywhere in between. When you fish this lure slowly, you have the classic grappler roll, maybe slightly exaggerated. If you fish this lure aggressively, it has the hard cutting side to side motion with a lot of vibration, with a tremendous flash. Combined with the, with the perfect minnow shape and the detailed scales and the lateral line that, and the flash of the holographic foil inside. And last, the teaser tail. Teaser tail moves even if you do not move the lure. And with the slightest twitch on your rod, the teaser tail, that's gonna have a movement and that's the last triggering aspect. That, I mean, you can catch any fish with this. You know you're right, Yarmo, the triggering aspects of the teaser tail and the colors, but when we talk about colors, we're bringing to you 12 pro-induced colors. For you guys that have your territories in the south, we got the right colors. You got this bass type of version here, green back, silver. This could pass for anything from a finger mullet to a shad to a baby bass. And we obviously have the gold colors. All these southern territories utilize these colors, and the consumers are already programmed for them. You got a bait with the right cosmetics and the good action that you're looking for. When we threw it back to the pros, we said what do we need for water clarity for parts of the country, whether it's fresh water, salt water, or multi-species categories. We went off the mark of the traditional Rapala color scheme, and we brought to you colors that are gonna work anywhere based on what the pros gave us. Today, most fishing lures are designed for very, very species-specific applications. The X-Rap, or Extreme Action Slash Bait, opens up a new lure category that applies to many freshwater and inshore fishing situations. This is the X-Rap, my dream lure for the 21st century.